you go into the case studies of just how what has been a very public spat has fallen out into some key well, future crises for these companies. Yeah, absolutely. So you, you do have this feud with Donald Trump, which is a big deal. I mean, I think you look at, like, why has Tesla's stock fallen over the past six months or so? A big, a big reason of that is it's kind of like it, it hit a high just after the election, and we've got had kind of a reverse Trump trade. But once you back away from the Trump of it all, you start to see three key companies, SpaceX, Tesla, X, all of which are attempting these huge, kind of monumental things with huge amounts of risk. I think it's a, it's a thing that Elon Musk has never tried to do before, really. We, we've never seen this in his career. As much as he's a guy who makes big bets, we have Tesla attempting to do a really like a hard pivot away from car manufacturing to robo-taxis, a, a competitive field, a, a field where they're not necessarily in the lead. We have Starship, this giant rocket, which has yet to fly yet. We've had three successive explosions during test flights. And then we have X, which looks very promising, XAI, but, but I think is clearly a little bit behind some of its competitors, OpenAI and Anthropic, and is lo losing huge sums of money. And you take all those three things, and then you take a poor relationship with the guy who's in power in the United States, and that is a dangerous recipe, I'd say. And it's a dangerous recipe that investors